Okay guys, so eyebrow tutorial. As you can see, I did one side already. So let's zoom in and go ahead and do this side. Um, zoom out a little just so it doesn't blur. Okay, so I know I have some like pimple and crap, so just, just don't mind that. Anyways, um, just a little background on my eyebrows. Sorry, I have to look at like my two uneven eyebrows. But um, I usually get them waxed, plucked, trimmed every like a month or so when I'm back at home. But when I'm not back at home, there's not much I can do. There's no one I trust up here. So I just try my best to, to um, clean it up as best as I can and shape it as best as I can and just fill it in. So... Um, my eyebrows look the best when I'm at home, but because I hardly do anything at home, like video-wise, you guys hardly see that. But this is about three weeks um, in, so I should be like almost getting a new um, eyebrow um, shaping, but that won't be happening for another couple months. So, anyways, that's what we're going for. The shadow that I use is called espresso I believe and this is what it looks like um yeah so that's the shadow I use and I use I think this is the Kirkland um brush it's the dual ended brush with the spoolie and the angled so I just go ahead and dip my brush into the um espresso and it's from MAC by the way and then what I do is I start from like the middle of my brow and that's where I put the color first and then I just follow the natural shape of my brow. And, um, whoa, sorry for the blur. I just follow the natural shape of my brow. Concentrating most of the color from like the middle of my brow to the end. Um, yeah. And then I'll slowly go towards the um, inner part of my brow and then fill them in and I can just clean it up with my fingers as I'm doing um, I want most of the color in the middle and at the end just because that's where I want it to be dark darker because um, I find sometimes when my brows are too dark in the middle it kind of looks funny so um, yeah, but I do color my brows the whole way through. And no, gosh, I'm so sorry, guys. Ugh. I don't know if this has been blurring the hair the whole time, but if it has, I'm sorry. So I just keep going over until I find the desired shape. As I said, my brows are not perfect. They don't match each other. Um, I don't think they're supposed to. I mean, I think they look more fake if you were to make them perfectly. So, um, I just follow the natural shape of whatever they do. So, um, yeah. So that's pretty much all I do, to be honest. I don't do the whole concealer thing, like putting concealer on top here and on the bottom here and bottom here and top there. I just don't do it. And, um, if anything, I'll take the spoolie side of the, the, um, brush and then I'll just go ahead and, like, shade it out. and do the same to the other side and just shade it out just so it's kind of not not too um not too dramatic so yeah that's how i do my brows <laughs> and i'm gonna do a tutorial after this so um i hope you guys enjoyed it. i hope this helps um um it's really easy so i don't know i wasn't gonna do it but everyone kept asking how i do my brows so so I do it. I just follow the shape. I don't really use any stencils or anything. Um, yeah, and that's it. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.